Well, first off, um, this is pretty amazing. And um, on behalf of everyone who work at Milestone and believe in something greater than ourselves, thank you all for bringing this story to life. Um, you know, we're now living in a time where everyone knows about these characters. You know, Thanos, everyone knows who Thanos is. Everyone knows that Tony Stark is Iron Man and Steve Rogers is Captain America. But in the 90s and before that, um, people who were comic book fans were reviled. They were outcasts, they were considered geeks. Comic books were considered the enemy of literature from librarians. But what a lot of people don't know is that comic books helped teach kids to read and it helped expand their vocabulary. Um, Stan Lee, who is a legend in regards to being a creative architect at Marvel Comics, believed in that very much in his stories expanded the literacy of kids. Um, and I can tell you that as much of a genius as Stan was, all due respect to him, he paled to the genius of Dwayne McDuffie. Dwayne McDuffie went to the Wharton School. He was a genius, he understood quantum physics, he understood music, and he understood literature. Mm. And as Stan was a model, he believed in using comics to expand our vocabulary. And so there was an issue of a comic book, um, an issue of Icon, and I opened the book, and the story is titled Enteleki. And I had never seen this word before, E-N-T-E-L-E-C-H-Y, okay? So I go home and I look this word up, I'm 24 years old, and it says the realization of potential. And that sounds very simple, but it's actually pretty complex. Um, there's a philosophical opinion to it. There's a scientific opinion to it. And it wouldn't be until years later that I realized what entelechy was. Entelechy is the wherewithal to change reality, to literally change reality. You are unsatisfied with the way things are. Mm -hmm. And you change it. And you realize your potential as an agent for change. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What you've seen here um, is a collective product, but it started with one man who engaged his own entelechy, and he realized his potential to change reality. And that's David. And, um, you know, people have asked me, well, how did you two connect? And um, this real called Static Shop got two million views on YouTube. <laughs> And you know, you see a lot of fan films and quite frankly, most of them are not good. But Static Shop was good. And I said, okay, I need, to, I need to find out who this guy is. And I believe I reached out to him on Facebook with a friend request and he kindly said yes. And we stayed in touch and we talked and I watched these films evolve into this reality that Warner Media with their billions and billions of dollars could not do. Mm. But David Kirkman is a human being that inspired people to gravitate to him and to go above and beyond to make this possible. Um, that's what IntelliKey is. Um, that's what Milestone was. Milestone was an experiment in changing a reality that the founders were not satisfied with. They were not satisfied with a world in which everyone did not have a chance to create heroes. They were not satisfied with a comic book industry that only represented a white male heterosexual view. Mm -hmm. And now it's almost 30 years later, since the company was founded in 1993, we're in an entirely different world. And to see this mythology that we toiled over month after month, victories and failures, to see that represented through a new lens and a new generation is nothing short of amazing. Yeah. And so on.